Hello and welcome back to the channel after a bit of a delay because life gets in the way sometimes for another what we do in the shadows recap and uh, this is citizenship from season one uh, we have Nadja looking after Jenna who's become a vampire in the most adorable klutziest way possible so Nadja takes it upon herself to teach her the ways of vampirism Meanwhile, Nandor is upset because he has discovered that the country that he is from hundreds of years ago has ceased to exist. So he feels like he is stateless. He has nowhere to call a home. Uh, here's Jenna learning that uh, it was more than just a bit of kissing that uh, she did with Nadia previously. She slowly does eventually work it out because, bless her, she's not super quick on the uptake. Uh, and we learn about Nandor's previous attempt to become an American citizen, hilariously based around his love of uh, basketball and the Olympics. So it turns out that vampires in the world of what we do in the shadows all have a special skill. So Nadja is trying to find Jenna's, whilst Guillermo. Uh, helps Nandor prepare for a citizenship test down at the immigration center. So the girls head to a local college party to practice some stalking. I just, I always love the scenes where we have the vampires in some kind of bureaucratic modern environment because they just stand out so much. Uh, but the bureaucrat, it turns out, has so little imagination he can't be hypnotized. So that gambit fails for poor Nandor. Uh, sadly, in the end, he doesn't get his citizenship, but it is quite funny uh, watching him try. And the reason why he fails ultimately is just full of imagination. And I love it. So good. Uh, meanwhile, Jenna is getting increasingly frustrated until she discovers <gasps> she can vanish her power is to become invisible which makes her and Nadia overjoyed cue some carnage at that party for some poor boys Guillermo is trying his best to cheer Nandor up reminding him that he is a great warrior and he shouldn't feel so disappointed that his country has disappeared and eventually Nandor does get his mojo back uh, to some extent and we get a nice little kind of touching friendship moment after this between him and Guillermo which of course ends in a bit of a comedy pratfall because you know it always does with these to screw and uh, meanwhile Jenna is learning the last bits about becoming a vampire she's excited that she can obviously attack boys and become invisible uh, disappointed to learn that she won't see the sunset anymore so she sights Blade and suggests that they put on some motorcycle helmets and watch the sun rise. Uh, but that does not go entirely according to plan and it's an attempt that is soon aborted. And yeah, that is season one's citizenship. Uh, a little bit of a placeholder after the climax of the trial, but still, as always with the show, it's fantastically fun.